season finishes, you kind of know what happened in the season's gone now. You've got to just concentrate on doing well for England. And your first and foremost, you want to make sure that you get into the 23 and get on that plane to South Africa. And once you're there, then all systems go. To be honest, just to go there as fit as we can go as a squad. I think there's been a lot of injuries around uh, the last back end of the season. If we can go there with all the players we've got, the manager wants, and that they're all fit, then we've got a great chance of doing well. I've been to three World Cups before this one, so I know the kind of rigmarole that goes on and the, 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 the craziness that surrounds a World Cup. So um, it's probably the experienced players to kind of help the younger players through it and don't get involved emotionally with, with all the surroundings that go on with a World Cup because if you get involved emotionally, then it kind of it takes away from what you can do on a pitch, I believe. Obviously, Spain being European champions and Brazil being South American champions, I'd say them two teams are the standout teams in terms of what they've achieved over the last couple of years So, um, and the form that they've been in. Uh, two very good fo footballing teams and teams full of confidence. I think they've got enough in depth to, to kind of deal with a lot of injuries to be on the show. If, if Fernando Torres doesn't play, they've got David Villa. So, I mean, they've got players all over the party. If Fabregas isn't fit, they've got Xavi and Iniesta, people like that. I'd say an African team. Cameroon, Ivory Coast, I'm sure, being in Africa as well, they want to do well on near home. Um, so, I'm sure they'll, they'll be a, a team to watch, the African teams. I'm looking forward to watching people like Messi and Ronaldo, to be honest with you. I want to see them play Rooney as well. I want to see them the top players produce. I think once that's what the World Cup's all about, is seeing the best players in the world put on shows. Maradona done it at the 1986 World Cup. I'd love Rooney to be one of the players, or one of our players, to be the stand-up player this World Cup, because that will mean that we'll go close to doing well. No, I've not spoken to him, but I'm sure when I see him, it'll be, it'll be a... Um, there'll be a right smile but, um, but yeah I think uh, people are kind of already saying oh we're going to qualify and we're going to beat these teams that Spain, that they beat Spain not so long ago uh, in, in a competition so USA won't be any pushovers we can't go on what must happen in the past it's a new time I think all of us have been involved in, in, more, in uh, penalties since so we need to take that experience and hopefully that will put us in good stead for the, for the coming, coming tournament if they need to be to, to be there.